Hi, my name is Scott. For today's video, we are looking over this MPPT charge controller. We're going to show you guys everything that you get within the kit. Okay, this is the charge controller. They give you a manual and screws and a sole, um, yeah, and a temperature probe cable as well. So this is how it looks. The temperature sensor connects into here. Very wide opening, so you can put very thick gauge wire in here. There are two USB ports on here, as well as an ether port. You have your load, your battery, and your solar. It has a very nice breathable bottom. That way, when it heats up, the heat can get dispersed and not trapped. On the back side here, it shows you all of your specs. So battery voltage, max PV input, 60 amps, 80 amps, 100 amps. 12 volt system, 48 volt, 36 volt. So this would be battery voltage would be 60 amps. Open circuit voltage would be 80 amps. It can handle max power voltage. It can handle 100. For 12 volt systems, 780 watts. For 48 volt systems, 1,040 watts. For 36 volt systems, 1,300 watts. For 24 volt systems, 1,560 watts. 96 volt, 2,080 watts. 72 volt, 2,600 watts. Very nice, sleek design. Couple specs right there. Now we're going to be installing this in the future for um, our garage that has no electric. So we'll how the, basically how this is going to work is you're going to take your solar panels and you're going to run the wires. The positive it goes in here, which would be on the bottom. The top here is just for your screwdriver and you loosen this up. You slide in your positive solar panel cable in here and then you tighten the screw down over the wire and then the negative goes down in here. And then your batteries that you have are going to connect into here. So your positive from your batteries and your negative from your batteries. And then load is just, um, I personally never use load. Some people use it for lights and just different stuff like that. I personally just never deal with it. So we have a few panels. I installed this tent, um, canopy tent, and I need to rewire the panels so we can get sun. But we have one, two, three, four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve panels right here we also have other panels um, on the side so this is our main system um this is a, another mppt charge controller so just to kind of give you an idea they all work the same positive solar negative solar cable positive battery negative battery and then you have your load and it's going to light up and here's all the batteries we have. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now, for setting up a solar system, I've had this system for over, oh man, three years now, at least three years. And to set up a system um, without issue, so this system has given us zero issue from day one. And basically, what you're gonna need. And we have this uh, lined up for a 12 volt system. I just personally like 12 volt. Um, it's just, you know, just my personal opinion. Solar panel wires run from outside all the way over to right here. So they run to right in here. So your solar panel wires run right into here. And then your battery cables run from there to your battery. As you can see, we have ours right here. And we have this set, our battery set up in sequent order, which basically means all batteries you see here charge the same. They keep the same voltage. Um, I just personally like doing that more than um, you know other ways. That's just again my personal opinion. So battery connects to the positive, negative, from there to the battery, and then you need something called an inverter. So you have your solar panels, you have your batteries, you have your charge controller, then you have an inverter. The inverter converts the power into actual usable uh, electric. 
So this is a 2000 watt inverter and the inverter connects to the batteries as well. And then the inverter allows you to plug in your standard three prong outlets and use whatever you want, TV, um, appliances, whatever you wanna, whatever your uh, charge controller and whatever your inverter can handle. As you see here, we have a security camera facing the inverter um, and that reads off 24 seven the levels. So I can look at my battery system levels, the voltage at any time, anywhere I am. Um, this, I would say our system saves us about $70 a month and this is all do it yourself. And again, I've never had a single issue with this system, not once. But again, that charge controller is going to work the same as this one right here. Once it's connected, you're going to light up. You're going to see different specs on it. Um, and yeah. I will definitely be giving an update actually using that charge controller. Um, but right now, we're still doing work in our garage. And I want to convert the garage to a three-car garage before we start doing with um, solar in the garage. But at least we have it now and we're ready to go.